right? So look everyone, we got uh, Mick on one, Aaron on two, Mankat on three, and Shane on four. Let's go. Mick, first question. Katrin Kikilati is a reality show on Indian TV adapted from the American series Pure Factor. To date, who is the only woman to host Katrin Kikilati? Her initial fame came with her winning the 2000 Miss World title. Uh, right. Aaron? Pass. Mankat. Lara Dutta. Incorrect. Shane. Pass. So this is Priyanka Chopra Jonas. Priyanka Chopra, isn't it? No, it's stuck in here. All right. And you're Sorry, it's recorded, isn't it? Yeah. Waves for Change is a nonprofit organization that won the Laureus Sport for Good Award for using surfing therapy for children from the townships and locations of which country? South Africa. Correct. Right. Aaron, you're here. On March 11, 2023, which mass media company celebrated its 100th anniversary, a red letter day, or, or shall we say a red border day in its history? Time. Time is correct. And you're next. Which planet is the least dense? It is so light that if you made a bathtub that is hypothetically that big, the planet would float in it. Saturn. Saturn is correct. And then cut here too. A bright side video has created these AI-based models of popular animated characters. Although technically he wouldn't be wearing a shirt, but the color would pretty much be the same. ID this AI-based animated character as the bright side, whose legs were no less than the wheels of a car, despite no cars existing back then. Red Flintstone. That's correct. And you're next. Described as one of the 20, 20th century's most significant buildings, which currently, country's current parliament house was designed by Estonian-born U.S. architect Louis Kahn? Construction began in 1964 and was completed only in 1982, with some delays attributable to events not connected with the actual construction. Bangladesh. Bangladesh is correct. I chain Europe. Set in the 1980s, the recently released film Air, based on true events about the origin of Air Jordan, has a great soundtrack that is jam-packed with hits from the era. Which instrumental piece by the Alan Parsons Project, best known as the song that was used to introduce the starting lineup of the Chicago Bulls, plays when Phil Knight goes up to the Nike headquarters on the night before the meeting to tell Sonny that he had made his final decision on the Michael Jordan deal. The title is shared with the biggest, brightest star in the sky, and we do have an audio as well. Sorry, could you repeat that question for me, Janty? <laughs> Serious. Correct. And you're next. In Drunk History, Series 6, Episode 16, Betsy Sodaro plays which Irish-born American cook who took a job in Oyster Bay, Long Island, in the household of New York banker Charles Henry Warren. She would soon be responsible for the predicament of their whole family and, and then go on to affect around 51 to 122 people by its end. Hi, Floyd Berry. Or Mary or Mary Mellon, this way. <laughs> everyone, next, back here. <laughs> Pandora and Prometheus are two examples of blank moons of Saturn. These two moons orbit between gaps of Saturn's rings, and because of their gravitational effect, they naturally and successfully confine the rings and prevent them from spreading out. Fill in the blank, a term borrowed from animal husbandry because of this effect. Ten seconds. Stable rings. Okay. Aaron. Sheepdog. Shane. Shepherd moon. Shepherd is what we're looking for. That's correct. That's a some uncharacteristic extravagance from you, there, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Why not? Uh, here you go. Rising above the banks of the river like a solitary tear suspended on the cheek of time. Is a line from a poem about an emperor written by a 1913 literature Nobel laureate. The line describes a monument, which is the subject of Stephanie Hunchell Smith's TED Ed video. Is this the most beautiful building in the world? Which monument? Uh, Taj Mahal. 
Hi, Erin. Amidst the Arab Spring, the season opener of the 2011 Formula One season had to be canceled due to anti-government protests with Crown Prince Salman bin Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa making the announcement. Which country was supposed to host this race? Bahrain? Bahrain is correct. Yeah, you weren't you weren't fooling anyone. It's needed to put all the other options out of my head. All right, your next one, Aaron. Alexis Ohanian, married to Serena Williams since 2017, was a co-founder of which website in 2005. His work with the website and his advocacy of an open internet led to Forbes dubbing him the mayor of the internet. Reddit. That is correct. Oh my god. The 66, sorry, the 69 stations of the Kiso Kaido or the 69 stations of the Kiso Road is a series of Yukioe prints created by Utagawa Hiroshige and Kaisai Aisen. The 17th station in the series is Sakamoto, a temple town at the foot of Mount Hiai. With its holy connotations, it has become a popular Japanese surname. One celebrity with the surname Kiyo Sakamoto was best known outside Japan for his international hit song, Ue Oimuite Oruko. How do we better know the song in the English speaking world, which may remind you of a hot pot dish with cooked beef? Sukiyaki. And you're next. UA is an organization that won the Laureus Sport for Good Award in 2019. It empowers girls from Jharkhand, a place with a high number of child marriage and human trafficking, to overcome violence and struggle with mm -hmm. Franz Gastler gave a 2015 TED Talk with Rinki Kumari titled "Ua: How Blank a Letters Are Sometimes Sick is Changing Lives. Fill in the blank with the sport very popular in Jharkhand. Seconds. Is it hockey? Incorrect. Right. Pass. Yeah. Pass. Yeah, I'll pass. It was football or soccer. So the eight letter was football and the six letter was soccer. Okay. All right. And Shane. Which media company owns the web website Reddit? The sale was done in 2006 for a reported $10 million to $20 million, 10 to $20 million, million dollar price. This company, which also owns, owns Wired magazine, is named for the business magnet picture. <laughs> Seconds. Monday Nast. And you're next. A Sudanese proverb goes salt comes from the north, gold from the south, but the treasures of wisdom are only to be found in blank. This forms the opening line of a TED Ed video by Elizabeth Cox titled The Hidden Treasures of Blank. What one word fills in both blanks? <laughs> Name answer. Sleep. Nick. Bus. Aaron. Bus. And Nick. Bus. Yeah, this kind of stumped us as well. This is Timbuktu, apparently, is the answer. I can show it to you. Anyway. All right, that wraps up two rounds. Mick, it's back to you. It's not a dried pasta, nor is, nor is it the name of a drop cookie from almond or coconut. Instead, it is, it is a sandwich cookie filled with sweet things. 
Although the root of all three food items is the same, Italian for fine paste, this dessert is made of meringue, sugar, almond flour, jam, ganache, cream, and chocolate in between. Which one? Hmm. Okay. Macaron. Macaron is correct. Okay. And you're next. The French, Swiss, Spanish, and German Grand Prix events in 1955 were canceled <laughs> to which other yeah. incident from the same year? <laughs> mm. No, I'm going to pass. Okay, Ellen? Pass. And Venka? There was this accident at the, at the Le Mans track, which... Uh, Le Mans is the answer I needed, so you got it. All right, and Aaron. The winner of the Nobel Economics Prize pedaled through the countryside in this bicycle, weighing babies and studying their weight difference. He later used the findings in designing the Human Development Index, measuring not only a country's economic growth, but also its capabilities and possibilities. Two, this bicycle is now an exhibit in the Nobel Museum in Sweden. Ten seconds. Full hack. Correct. Nick. Pass. Okay. Myrdal. Incorrect. And then cut. Amartya Sen. Amartya Sen is correct. Uh -huh. All right. And Aaron. The title of this book, Pictured, became, first became popular as a line uttered by Kyrtishian, a mathematician who specialized in chaos theory, in which blockbuster film. He says it is, he says it's to insist a belief that has, sorry, uh, that as per the history of evolution, life will not be contained in society. Ten seconds. A beautiful mind. Nope. Jurassic Park, bit bit mm -hmm. mainstream. My colleague here. Yeah, I actually haven't seen it, so there you go. <laughs> <laughs> you'll let us see it. All right, then cut to your two. In 1655, which Dutch scientist was the first to discern Saturn's rings? He also discovered Saturn's biggest moon, Thailand, and was the first to explain Saturn's strange appearance as due to a thin, flat ring, nowhere touching and inclined to the ecliptic. Christian Huygens. Correct. All right, and you're next. An Elephant in the Garden is a 2010 book by Michael Morpurgo. Set in 1944, Elizabeth and Carly live with their mother who works in a zoo in a city that is about to be bombed. In order to prevent the animals run wild, they are required to be shot, and in an attempt to save one elephant, their mother brings them to their backyard. Which city did they live in whose bombing was also a part of a semi-sci-fi no novel in the 1960s? The Dresden? Dresden Day and the book is Slaughterhouse Five. All right. Um, and Shane. The House, Houses of Parliament of South Africa, situated in Cape Town, were first completed in 1884, picture on left, and an extension was made in the 1920s. A third extension, seen picture on the right, became a necessary in 19, the 1980s due to new legislation, which changed the 1910 constitution. Uh, 
the uh, announcer? Architecture Act. I don't know. Mick. Bus. Aaron? The end of apartheid. Incorrect. And Venkat. Bus. This is the tricameral constitution. If I know, I'll show you the answers to the slew of options. But I think specifically they wanted tricameral or separate parliament. Was there. All right, and Shane. One theory behind the fried, this fried dessert talks about Spanish shepherds developing a quick, fulfilling food to carry with them to the mountains and naming it for their resemblance to fruit of bees. The Portuguese claim to have discovered it in the 15th century during the cultural exchange of the Ming Dynasty. Which dessert would Spain, Portugal, and China all had in claims to? Churro. Churro, that's correct. All right. Next, I'll get back to it. The November 2nd, 2020 issue of the U.S. edition of the magazine was the first time that the cover logo Time was not used. The cover of that issue used the word, word vote along with the artwork by which person of a voter wearing a pandemic mask? No, Leibowitz. Yeah. Aaron? Pass. Shane? Pass. Aaron, thank you. Bus. This is um Shepherd Ferry with the Obama poster. Yeah, I got oh. that far. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. And this AI-based animated character for, is from a mid-1990s movie. However, it is in turn based on a real-life person from four centuries ago. ID her whose voice can make you see the colors of the young. All right, as this is a film, I won't go the smart ass answer. Um, Pocahontas, I'll say. Yeah. All right. I was hoping for the smart ass answer myself. I was going to say Rebecca Rolf, but I thought let's not be that guy. Yeah. All righty. And Eric, which possessively titled song, Moran DMC, aptly plays when athletic apparel and footwear corporations execs are preparing to meet with Michael Jordan and his parents in air? This 80s song is previously mentioned by the Nike execs to showcase how popular the brand in question was at the time. Right? Shit. I'm oh, sorry. I thought I killed it by mistake. We'll, we'll get that in the edit. What? I said we'll get we'll get the profanity in the edit. Ten seconds, there. My Adidas. My Adidas is good. Right, and then next. Which former bodybuilder won the Laureus Sport for, good, for a good award in 2003 for his work with the Special Olympics <laughs> four years after his former mother, <laughs> Eunice Nerdy Shriver, won the same award for essentially forming the Special Olympics? Arnold Schwarzenegger. All right, and then next. This honey sweetened nut filled pastry's origin goes back to the Assyrians in the 8th century BC. The dessert served as a point of contention over the Turks and Greeks as to who invented it. Particularly in Greece, it is supposed to be made with 33 dough layers, referring to the years of Jesus' life. Which dessert? Baklava. Correct. Yeah. And the next. In February 2016, Time mistakenly included which male author on its 100 most read female writers in college classes list. He was 97. <laughs> the error created much media attention and concerns about the level of basic education among the magazine staff. Time later used a retraction. Uh, Evelyn Ball. Right, nice guy. All right, okay. An effective method to increase the number of potential organ donors is to make people donors by default with the option to opt out. This is an example of which theory developed by Richard Taylor and Cass Sunstein, which states that the choice architecture can influence behavior and decision making of groups or individuals. Nudge theory? Nudge theory is correct. And you're next. 
The title of this book, Pictured, be first became popular as a line uttered by Rod Tidwell, an Arizona Cardinals wide receiver, to his sports agent in which blockbuster film. He says that to this to his agent over the tele says that to his agent over the telephone, reassuring that he is still his son. Jerry Maguire. Right. All right, that wraps up four rounds and it's back to you, Mick. What historical town, the site of a decisive battle fought in October 20, on October 20, 21st, 1600, is the 58th station in the series named after. This battle was a critical episode in the unification of Japan with Tokugawa Iyasu, 1642 to 1616, who, who subsequently found the last of the Japanese shogunal governments based at Edo, Tokyo, 1603. Uh, no. Nara. No. Aaron? Us. Okay. Sekigahara. Sekigahara is correct. All right. In Drunk History, season series one, episode three, um, Bill Hader played which American pharmacist and Confederate Army veteran who was working hard to create a recipe which would sell in the name of medicine, though it had no proven benefits. Historian Phil Mooney cites that it was first created in Columbus, Georgia, then Atlanta, and it then eventually becoming the most popular kind. Of Um, Pemberton. Yeah, nice right, and Aaron. Which 2023 Amazon Prime video spy thriller stars Priyanka Chopra as Nadia Sim, an agent working for the titular organization renowned for its safe and secretive operations? The word fortress is typically associated with this word, and AJ Cronin definitely did not write the screenplay. Ten seconds. Quantico. That's incorrect. Make. Pass. Banker. Banker. Citadel. Citadel is correct. <coughs> All right, and Aaron. Elephants in My Backyard is a book by Rajiv Surendra, Kevin G. from Mean Girls, about his yearning and pursuit to be the lead in a 2012 Hollywood movie that was based on a 2001 novel. The title alludes to Rajiv growing up next to a Toronto Zoo, quite like the character in the book or the film. Who grew up in a South Asian zoo? Which book or film? Life of Pi. Life of Pi is correct. All right, and like, which 1984 song, hit song, actually describes a Vietnam War veteran who returns home to desperate circumstances and few options and is not an uncomplicated celebration of patriotism, as clarified by Rob Strasser in Air? NPR considers this song to be the most historically misunderstood and even clarifies that the artist had originally titled the song Vietnam. Born in the USA. Born in the USA, correct. Right. And the next. In Drunk History Season 3, Episode 11, titled The Visit of Menlo Park, Chris Parnell plays a titular inventor who is approached by a photographer with a long white beard. He shows him a device containing a series of photographs, which when spun in the cylinder performed an illusion. Who is a photographer whose idea gets stolen by the inventor? Is it uh, Edward Mybridge? Right. right, Shane. What is the 37th UPOE print <clears throat> name of the series? Serving as a security check checkpoint for the Tokugawa Shogunate, it was abolished in 1868 after the Meiji Restoration. However, it returned to global consciousness as the site of Japan's worst ever disaster caused by the Tohoku earthquake and tsunami, the most powerful earthquake ever recorded in Japan. Fukushima. He shares his first name with the Portuguese mariner and his middle name with the 2019 Taika Waititi film. 
but his shortened first name is actually an anagram of a word that represents his mischievous and rebel mischievousness and rebelliousness. <laughs> I read this AIBA's character as per Brightside, who is the only son in the family besides two sisters, first and last name. Okay, Bart Simpson. Bart Simpson is correct. So what's the answer again? It was Bart Simpson. Oh. You want me to show it to you, I can. Here you go. All right, it wraps up five rounds. Make it back to you. Which 2009 winner of the Economics Nobel Prize, A Trailblazer in More Ways Than One, argued that communities are often very practical in reality and find ways to manage shared resources? This person cited the, cited the Alpine communities in Switzerland and Germany who manage common grazing areas without government intervention. This is a counterpoint to the arguments made in the tragedy of conflict. Kahneman. That's incorrect. <clears throat> Aaron? Us. Shane. Ostrom? Eleanor Ostrom is correct, the first female e economist in, to win the Nobel Prize. There we go. All right. Um, and in 2006, who was named Equal Partner, also called founder sometimes in Reddit, when the company merged with this person's company in Fugami? This pioneer of the open access movement was fired in 2007 for undisclosed reasons. This internet activist was inducted posthumously into the Internet Hall of Fame after his sudden death in January 2013. Hmm. Smith. Aaron? Uh, us. And Pass. Pass. Aaron, he has your first name. It's Aaron Swartz. <laughs> All right. And Aaron, you're direct. The House of the Government of the Russian Federation serves as a Russian parliament and was built over 1965 to 1981. During the August coup attempt of 1991, it came to be called but what by the media, a name that has stuck ever since, even Sorry, though Vladimir Putin may not appreciate associations with another structure 7,816 kilometers away. Ten seconds. Um, Duma. No, sorry. Mick? It's the White House. Okay. All right, and Aaron. Yeah. In the Ted Ed video titled White Plague Doctors Wore Masks, the appropriate quote, as far as possible, one must refuse to be on the side of pestilence, from which 1947 novel is shown to start off the video. The author is the second youngest literature Nobel laureate. Hope you accept the plague. The plague, I cannot was correct. All right, and thank you. The, the 1957 F1 season saw the cancellation of the Dutch and the Belgian Grand Prix events due to the extreme fuel prices in both countries. As a result, the organizers could not pay the required money to host the race. What political crisis indirectly caused the cancellation? Ten seconds. Is that oil embargo in the Middle East? Like? The Suez Crisis. All right, and like that. He has spent two decades pursuing answers to questions about poverty using the randomized control testing method, leading to her team being called randomistas. Her work includes HIV prevention in Kenya, future incentives to improve student results, bundling health insurance and microfinance, and improving immunization rates in India. Who is the who is this, the youngest recipient and the second woman to be awarded the economics Nobel?
Ten seconds. Sophie, something plus. <laughs> Erin? Yes, did you flu? Did you flu? Correct. I see them. All right, and Shay. Priyanka Chopra's foray into TV came in which ABC drama thriller series 2015 to 2018, sharing its name with the town in Virginia. Chopra plays Alex Parrish, introduced to us as an FBI Academy recruit and later as a field agent. Quantico. You went, you went wrong, Aaron. You were early. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Joseph and Eric suffer from a debilitating deforming condition, which sometime, which some suggest might have been, been neurofibromatosis. He was affected more on the right side and received horrific treatments. By 1888, he still lived in London's White Chapel. This is a synopsis of which book, a biography written by Ashley Montague. It was later made into a film. The Elephant Man? Right. All right. We have two more rounds to go. We have Shane in the lead now with 13 and Mink at 12 and Aaron and Mick with 9 and 8. All right, Mick. Which song, Die Streets, is most commercially successful single plays during Air's opening montage, highlighting the 80s as a whole? According to Mark Knopfler, when in New York City, he had visited an appliance store where televisions were all tuned to MTV. An MTV ad featuring the police inspired him to use the network slogan, I want my MTV in the lyrics. And thus, the songwriting credits are shared. Uh, money for nothing. And you're next. And it's for free. In the beginning of this no novel, Jacob makes fun of another nursing home resident who claims to have worked in the circus and carried the blank blank wing five, three, and nine. This lends the novel its title, which if put to an estimation would be anywhere around 26 to 80 gallons, not the amount available in the circus, which Sarah Gwen novel is. Uh, so I don't want to give Aaron thinking time. Yeah. Wow. Sorry, man. Water for elephants. Uh, yeah. That one. And her. In the Drunk History Season 3, Episode 6, Taryn Killian plays a 29-year-old American who, in 1972, had one of his biggest battles in Reykjavik, Iceland. Advertised as a Cold War concentration, it attracted huge worldwide attention. Who did Killian play? Someone who incidentally also passed away in Reykjavik. Bobby Fischer. Bobby Fischer. And you're next. Can you identify this little girl from Mexico who just loves the outdoors? Her pet anthropomorphic monkey is, however, missing from this AI recreation in a bright side video. He's got her backpack, backpack, right? Stora the Explorer. Super annoying. But anyway, um, all right, and Venker. In 2012, he sold his company, Looped, that he had co founded for 43.4 million US dollars. He was the president of e Combinator briefly the CEO of Reddit, and sat on Reddit's board of directors for seven years till 2022. Who is he, currently the CEO of OpenAI, of ChatGPT, and also of Dolly Fitton? Pass. Mick? Pass. Shane? Pass. And Eric? Pass. The oh, uh, ultimate, is it an ultimate? Yeah, yeah. that's right. All right, and like this. Darkness fell, not the darkness of a moonless or cloudy night, but as if the lamp had been put out on a, in a closed room, is a line from a letter from Pliny the Younger to Cornelius Tacitus describing an event. The event was part of a TED -ed video titled so Run, Sail, or Hide. How to blank what event? The assassination of Julius Caesar. I'm correct, Mick. Corruption of Vesuvius. Right, and Shane. <laughs> Making observations and writing notations about Saturn in their notebooks, Greek <laughs> astronomers use the letters Kappa and Rho abbreviated, along with the cross to represent the planet. Why were they using Kappa and Rho?
كان في تنسى differentiate from venus pass pass the greek equivalent of saturn is chronos um all right and shane the second winner of the laureus sport award sport for good award in 2001 is which kenyan former athlete and two-time olympic gold medalist who was who has conducted humanitarian work in his home country He's among the first in a long line of successful middle and long distance runners to come from this nation. Kip Kano. That's correct. All right, last round. Uh, Mix on 10, uh, Aaron on 12, Bankard on 13, and Shane on 14. I think. Also uses a met metonym like crown for royalty for the New Zealand political leadership. What is the common name given to the executive wing of the New Zealand Parliament buildings in Wellington? Yeah. This comes from its shape yeah. of a basket made from wicker plastic with mud and dung and used for a certain dreary activity. Let me say theatrical, Aaron. Um, that is the beehive. Right. And you're next. The title of this book picture be first became popular as a line uttered by, <laughs> by police chief Martin Brody. I haven't seen this either, Aaron. I haven't, but I'm in the line. <laughs> he said See, that after realizing I'm a door. He's all over that one. Um, that would be Jules. And that would be right. All right. And Aaron. This dessert of Scottish origin and proof of his preparation existed since the 1100s. But it was sweetened and dried until hard. It's in 1561, the leavening agent was replaced with butter, which impressed Mary Queen of Scots, which diminutive desert, dessert, sorry, that also goes by the bastardization of the French phrase, meaning little cakes. You just want shortbreads all that day. Exactly. It's a lot of a lot of words for shortbread. Yeah. You're right. Oh, yeah. diminutive. Right, that's short. Yeah. Okay. Your your life was about to become worthless then, Aaron. It's just I just didn't understand the clue anyway. All right. All right, guys. Um, all right. See you on the next one. If this first prince is in the series Nihon Bashi, names the business district of Chuo, Tokyo, which grew up around the construction of the same <laughs> which has linked two sides of the eponymous river since the 17th century. Just tell us what Nihonbashi translates to, giving us the English title of an iconic Claude Monet painting. Japanese bridge. That's right. That was cute. I like that one. <laughs> All right, and then good. Uh, in this 2017 film, Priyanka Chopra played the antagonist, a powerful businesswoman named Victoria Leeds. The <laughs> film was based on a TV series that ran from 1989 to 2001 that was mostly set in LA and sometimes in Hawaii. Which film or TV series? Be watch. That's correct. And your last direct. The title of this book picture first became popular as the line uttered by the protagonist in which film? He says the line while looking at himself in the mirror. Taxi driver. Okay, last questions. Shane. The autodromo Enzo Idino Ferrari hosts the Redacted Grand Prix, which is also in, called informally called the Imola Grand Prix, which Italian region is the Grand Prix hosted in, which also fills in the blank with the official name of the Grand Prix. In 2023, the Grand Prix was canceled due to extreme floods in the region. Did you say something? No, not yet. Four seconds. Tuscany. Incorrect, mate. Pass. 
Aaron? Lombardi? Nope, and Venkat. Emilio Romagna. Nice. It's Emilia Romagna. I'm not sure how strict you guys are here. Yes. It's Emilia Romagna. It's not Emilia. I think it was yeah, I think it was right. Okay. Yeah. And then the very last one. And because in the US that would be next, so I'm not sure. Yeah. Yeah. Which American is the most frequently featured person on the cover of Time magazine? Having appeared <clears> from <throat> August 25th, 1952 to May 2nd, 1994. Richard Nixon. So congrats, Venkat on the win. Shane, second, 15, and Aaron, 14, and Mick, 12. Well played, everyone. And yes, thanks for reading. Yeah, thanks. 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 Thanks